was good. I had to voice my opinion. Because before, before, <laughs> not nah, before, it was the bird box that was trending. Now it's this R. Kelly, Surviving R. Kelly documentary, which is like a six episode thing. And everyone is feeling some type of way because they're like, they knew some things done happen. But everything then came out the bag. It's crazy. <clears throat> but what I was trying to speak on is a lot of people now feel some type of way about anyone listening to their music or the fact that Drea Kelly was bumping R. Kelly after she just spoke her piece in this documentary. And I was telling people that has nothing to do with, you know, R. Kelly's musical talent. His personal has nothing to do with the music, just like with the Chris Brown thing. And honestly, there's been so many celebrities that have done some crazy things. Like, look at Behind the Music. They didn't abuse drugs, abused um, alcohol, didn't abuse their women, didn't, didn't went crazy. You don't know what people have went through and have done in their personal. That doesn't take away from their music or their acting skills. You cannot make nobody, like... You cannot take away from that just because of they personal. That's like saying, you know me just because of the color of my skin. And that's what a lot of people do. They try to judge you. Oh, she black, so she ghetto, or she this, or she that, or he's he's a thug because he's sagging, and he ain't smart because he smoked weed. My personal has nothing to do with anything else. So just like stop judging people off of their personal things. That has nothing to do with the other things that they may be good at in their lives. I don't care. Like, not saying that I'm condoning or like it wasn't wrong what these women have been through dealing with R. Kelly. But what I am saying is this man has made some great music over the years. And a lot of y'all probably had some babies off of his music. Like, don't start acting like, oh, no. We condone what he's doing because we're listening to his music now. No, that's not what it is. But if somebody makes good music, they make good music. I mean, they had all this beef, even up to today, that they bring back up about Biggie and Pop. And I like both of their music. I don't know what they did in their personal. Soul, drugs, gang bang, I don't know. But their music was good. Okay? Period. I don't know. That's just how I feel. But I mean, you guys can voice your opinions. You know, let me know in the comment section what y'all feeling. 